Hey Pisces, welcome to your mid-January 2021 reading. My name is Johanna, welcome to Tenacious Soul. We're gonna go through some general messages for you guys for the rest of the month. So take what resonates, leave the rest. Uh, you can always check out your sun, your moon, and your rising signs. Make sure you guys like and subscribe if you enjoy these messages. It would be greatly appreciated. All right. <clears throat> Let's see what we've got going on for Pisces. What's happening for Pisces mid-January 2021? Pisces mid-January. Page of Cups, Nine of Wands, Two of Cups, Three of Cups, Seven of Pentacles, Ace of Wands, King of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, Five of Swords. Okay, bottom of the deck we have the Fool, the Lovers, King of Swords, Eight of Swords, Two of Pentacles, Page of Pentacles, Hermit, Hierophant. Um, okay, so there's some sort of a new connection coming in with this um, King of Swords person. You're kind of unsure and not very clear, you know, maybe not communicating yet about where you like whether you want to choose this person or not like i feel like it's a new person coming in uh it's like you're unsure you're not clear i feel like you're trying to figure it out you're trying to like um there's something that like might go against your beliefs or you're trying to figure out does this belong like is this what i I believe in or can this person give me what I want or what I need um, it could be I feel like in the past there was somebody who kind of came around and tried to offer you love or an apology I feel like you kind of resisted that person I feel like it was a person that you used to be in a connection with But you've been waiting for something new. So in the in the current energy here, we have the Three of Cups, Seven of Pentacles, and the Ace of Wands. You've been waiting for something new um, that makes you happy, that can make you feel good. I feel like this didn't work out. This this didn't pan out. It's like you kind of rejected that. You're you're looking for something um, more real. I feel like almost like what they had to offer wasn't wasn't good or you keep coming into connections that don't match up to what it is that you really want and then in the near few or sorry yeah the near future here we have the king of pentacles the knight of pentacles and the five of swords i almost feel like um there is a person here that comes in this king of pentacles it's almost like they're moving very slowly though and it's almost causing some conflict here because you're just like i don't understand i don't understand why this person is like taking forever um, but I feel like, I feel like they're a very grounded individual. It could be an earth or an air sign. Definitely earth. Um, could be. Let's see where we go here. I want to see what this page of cups here is. What is this page of cups for Pisces? Queen of Swords, Ace of Wands. So this person wanted to talk about, I think almost like, I feel like you kind of like stood your ground and you were like, no, I'm looking for something new. I'm looking for something better. I'm looking for this Ace of Wands. 
some of you, yeah, like it took a lot for you to stand your ground and wait for something new, something better. What is this Two of Cups here for Pisces? Clarify this Two of Cups for Pisces in the past. Clarify this Two of Cups for Pisces. The Empress and the Knight of Cups. With the King of Cups at the bottom. So you want, like, you're looking for a connection of definitely somebody who can offer you more. Offer you the love you deserve. Um, and I feel like you're wanting, like, you're wanting something to grow. You're wanting th things, things to grow into, um, there is, like, a very, like, romantic vibe to it, like, you might be somebody who's like heavily romantic, like you romanticize about relationships or you romanticize rel relationships. Um, but it's like you want something that's going to be very abundant and it's going to grow into a family. It's going to, it has potential to last, right? Um, you're wanting real love. So let's see what this Ace of Wands is that you've been waiting for here. So let's see what this Ace of Wands is. What's its Ace of Wands? Okay. I'm going to take that one too. Queen of Pentacles. Ace of Pentacles. Seven of Cups. Three of Pentacles. Some of, some of you are definitely looking at like all of your options. You could be dating. Yeah, you're you're waiting for what, like your dream relationship or your like ideal relationship. You're waiting for that, and you're not really settling. I feel like you're good on your own with the Queen of Pentacles here. It's like you got you got your shit together, so like you're okay. You don't need anybody else. But it's like you're you're tired of being ghosted with this um, five of pentacles, six of pentacles, like people who just like walk away, end things, they breadcrumb you, right? They only give you what you want to hear to keep you around for themselves. And I feel like you're kind of done with that. You're looking for something. I feel like you guys are, I feel like you guys are possibly dating, but you're taking your time and you want someone who's going to invest in this situation. Um, and I feel like you'll, you'll wait for the right person. So let's see what this King of Pentacles is then. What is this King of Pentacles? Clarify this King of Pentacles. Clarify this King of Pentacles for Pisces, please. Yeah, two of wands. You're waiting for this person. I don't think they're here yet. <laughs> and I think that's maybe why you're frustrated because you're like, this is taking forever. Like, why is this person so slow? And you're kind of like questioning more so the universe. I feel like you know this person's out there for you and you're trying to manifest them into your life, I feel. Uh, you're ready for it. But you're, it's like you need strength to wait for this person. You need to have strength and not, to not go back to this other person who's just kind of like around you and convenient, you know? Um, let's clarify this five of, one, or five of Swords. What is this Five of Swords here for Pisces? Clarify this Five of Swords for Pisces, please. Five of Swords for Pisces. The Eight of Cups in Reverse. With the Lovers. Yeah, it's like you want it so bad you can't walk away. Or it's like you not really walk away. It's like you can't not think about it. It's like so in your head. Like... In a way, it's almost like keeping you stuck. 
Let's see, when is this person coming? What's this Knight of Pentacles? When is this person coming in? <laughs> You're definitely getting tired of waiting. Tell me more. It could be four months. Four months. One to four months. With the emperor. Yeah, you're waiting for like the person. We have the emperor, the empress out here. We have the king and the queen of pentacles. You're waiting for that divine counterpart, that person who's legit, the person who like, you can go the distance with this person. You can go the distance. I wanna get a, um, what's an outcome card? So tell me, what is the outcome here for Pisces? What is the outcome here? What is the outcome? For Pisces, what do they need to know for their outcome or advice? Outcome or advice. We have the lovers, the king of cups. This, I've seen this king of cups a few times. The emperor again at the bottom. Somebody who is going to offer you a lot of love. I feel like this king of cups could be the person because I've kind of seen at the bottom of the deck. It's like floating around. I feel like this person is going to have a lot of love for you. Um, but, like, you're needing to, like, stick to what you want. Like, be very clear on what it is that you want. Some of you maybe need to take more proactive. I feel like you are because I, I feel like you're dating. So you're taking that proactive stance on it. Anything else for Pisces mid-January regarding this spread? Anything else for Pisces? Anything else for Pisces? Nothing. But yeah, you're definitely getting tired of waiting. Could be the next few months, though, I feel. Um, what is the Divine Abundance message here for Pisces? What do we have for Pisces here? Divine Abundance message. We have signs. Instincts are the message from the inner divine. So pay attention to the signs and pay attention to your intuition because I feel like you could be getting like messages. You're not, maybe not focusing on them. And then we have energetic clearing. During crises, the Holy One herself may be emptying you of fear and attachments, preparing you to receive her luminous plan. So if you've been waiting a long time for a committed relationship, I feel like um one pay attention to the signs but i also feel like there's a reason um that you've had to wait and it could be because you're kind of like they're preparing you for like the one maybe you're learning a lot of lessons or not maybe you are right everybody is you're always learning lessons especially when we're alone and we have to work through those energies on our own and kind of like come to realizations like why does this keep happening or that or why can't i get this to work right um i feel like there is i feel like there's a person and they'll come in when the time is right they'll come in when the time is right is kind of what i'm feeling so that's what I have for you, Pisces. Hopefully that was helpful for you guys. Let me know down in the comments below. Make sure you like and subscribe. And thank you so, so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.